This is a story called The Little Monsters at Christmas, Chapter 55. Some extra special surprises for each of the kids. It's a few days after Christmas and the kids think that they've had all their Christmas presents. What they don't realise is that they have loads more to come. They're all at Kicker's house playing when Kicker's mum, Jane, said, Come on guys, it's time to go home. How come everyone has to go home, Mum? Why can't they stay? Asked Kicker. Well, you know how you all thought that you'd got all your Christmas presents? Well, you haven't because you all have some extra special surprises to come. And that's why you all have to go home, said Kicker's Mum. She took everyone home and then everyone was given their presents. The next day, they all went to each of the houses to see what extra presents they got. The first house they went to was Kicker's. Kicker's extra Christmas presents. Some more clothes, some makeup, some tickets to a pop concert, some hair straighteners, a hairdryer, £150 cash, a computer with a printer, monitor and everything else including computer desk some computer software and some memory sticks Ellie's extra Christmas presents a reborn doll that looked just like her a girl's world with makeup another new generation doll another doll's pram a 50 pound shopping, vou- shopping voucher for the local toy shop a massive doll that was as big as her and a tablet Everyone stayed at Kicker's to play for a bit and then they went, they all went to Creeper's house. When they got there, their mum had already put some snacks out for everyone. As usual, Stumpy made a beeline for them and all together everyone said, Don't you dare, Stumpy. They're for everyone, not just you. Everyone laughed and then Creeper and Michael showed them their presents. Creeper's extra Christmas present. A reborn doll that looked just like her. Loads of makeup, some hair straighteners, some more clothes, some tickets to a pop concert, a £150 shopping voucher, some false nails and equipment to do them myself, and a pair of Doc Martin boots that were fair lined and the ones she wanted. Michael's extra Christmas presents, a huge remote control car, a huge remote control aeroplane, loads more dinosaurs, some camping stuff for his tent, a huge remote control helicopter, some Lego, a huge remote control ball and some Play-Doh. They all spent the rest of the night playing at Creepers as they were all staying the night, even the little ones. However, it got to about 7pm and all the little kids had fallen asleep. Karen Creeper's parents took them upstairs to Michael's room and put them to bed. A couple of hours later, the older kids went to bed. When they got up the next day, they stayed and played at Creeper's for a few hours and then they all went to Bumpy's house to see what had in the little sister Mary Ann got. Bumpy's extra Christmas presents, some makeup, some other beauty products such as false nails, a £150 shopping voucher, a phone, a tablet, some hair straighteners, a hairdryer, and some more clothes. Mary Ann's extra Christmas presents, a toy washing machine, a toy vacuum cleaner, a toy dryer, a reborn doll that looked just like her. A huge kitchen with pretend food and pots and pans, some pretend air straighteners and a toy iron, an ironing board. Then Bumpy's mum came in and said, Bumpy and Mary Ann, please sit on the sofa and close your eyes because me and your dad have another surprise for you. Hang on a minute, guys.
They did as they were told and then their dad came in and told them to open their eyes. When they did, he was stood with a golden Labrador puppy in his arms. They couldn't believe it. They called their Bella, which was Mary Ann's favourite name. They all stayed at Bumpy's and played with baby Bella for a couple of hours and then they went to Grumpy's house. When they got there, Grumpy's mum was putting out some snacks for them and Stumpy tried to go to them. However, Kicker and Creeper stopped him and he said, I'm hungry. Everyone looked at each other and then at Stumpy and all together they said, You're always hungry, Stumpy. Everyone laughed and then Grumpy and Joanna showed everyone their extra presents. Grumpy's extra Christmas presents, a set of proper woodwork tools, a new tent big enough for eight people and some other camping gear, a new bed and bedroom makeover, a phone, a computer, a £150 shopping voucher, some more trainers, some pens for school and loads of arts and crafts stuff. Joanna's extra Christmas presents, another two our generation dolls, a huge toy kitchen with toy food and pots and pans, some more clothes, a £50 shopping voucher, a new bed and bedroom makeover, loads of our favourite sweets and some Barbie dolls. That night all the older kids stayed at Grumpy but the little ones all wanted to go home so Grumpy's dad took them. That night the gang played for a few hours and then they went to bed. The next day when they got up they played at Grumpy's for a few hours and then they went to Stumpy's house to see what him and his little brother Joshua got. When they got there Stumpy's mum said to him, Stumpy, I'm going to put some snacks out but they're for everyone not just you. Everyone laughed, ate their snacks and then Stumpy and Joshua showed everyone their presents. Stumpy's extra Christmas presents, a phone, loads of Lego, some more clothes, some more trainers, a £150 shopping voucher, some more woodwork tools, some more wood, some paint for school and a computer. Joshua's extra Christmas presents, a huge remote control robot, a remote control car, a remote control boat, a remote control police helicopter, a new bed and bedroom makeover, some dinosaur bedding and some more clothes. When they finished looking at Stumpy and Joshua's extra presents they all played for a bit but then the little ones fell asleep again. Stumpy's mum rang their parents to let them know that they'd fallen asleep and that she'd keep them there overnight. The big kids went to bed a couple of hours later. The following day they all stayed at Stumpy and played for a while and then they all went to Stumpy's house to see what extra presents him and his little sister Elizabeth had got. When they got there they all had some snacks and then Stumpy and Elizabeth showed them their presents. Stampy's extra Christmas presents, a phone, a computer, some more camping gear, a bed and a bedroom makeover, some more clothes, a £150 gift voucher, some more trainers, some woodwork tools, a computer and a computer desk, Elizabeth's extra Christmas presents, a doll that walks and talks, and of an our generation doll, some trainers, some more Barbie dolls, a huge kitchen with accessories, some more clothes and a bed and bedroom makeover. After they'd been looking at stamping after they'd finished looking at stamping Elizabeth's new stuff, all their parents came in and told them all to sit down. Then they told them that they were going away in the summer to Disney World in Florida together as a group for a whole month. They were all very excited. That night the little ones went home with their parents and the gang slept at Stampy's. End of chapter 55. Hope you like it guys. Take care, love yous. Bye.